Okay, hello dear friends. Here we have some problem of hyperbola. My handwriting is a little bit, uh, yeah, a little bit sorry looking. Okay, the first problem. X square over 25 minus Y minus 1 square equal to 1. What do they want to want us to do? Identify, identify the four key. Identify four key of each, and then sketch the graph. S K. Sketch the graph. Okay. So for this one, what is the four key? And. Uh, <clears throat> Four key should be uh, the center should be x. Um, x is zero. Center. Let me write it down. Center is zero and positive one. And uh, uh, a equal to five. B equal to one. C equal to root 26 right because c square equal to a square plus b square this one and y minus 1 you can see as y minus 1 over 1 so c is a, c is a root 26 now here we can see this is x is on top, x is positive. So this hyperbola, I will just draw a rough graph. Will be like this. And the vertex, here is the center. So it's 0 and y is 1. So here is the center. Do I make any sense? I will. It, it needs to move up one, one, um, one number, and uh, vertex is negative one, positive one, positive one, uh, five. Positive one, negative five, positive five, and here will be negative root twenty six, positive one, and uh, this is the four key. Four key. Positive twenty six, root root twenty six and one. So what is the four key? Four key, four key, four 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 chi, four chi will be negative root twenty six one and positive root twenty six one. So here I will use a paper to draw it more carefully. <coughs> straight whenever I need a ruler ruler will disappear okay now let me try to draw a graph so this is the Car Cartesian Carti Car Cartier Descartes the, the, the quadrant and the center will be 0, 1. This is the center, so it's uh, symmetric to this point. So there will be the new center here. Maybe I should use another graph uh, paper. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5. This is the vertex. One, 
two, three, four, five, negative five. So negative five, positive one, and uh, positive five, positive one. This is a vertex. And uh, because x squared minus uh, over 25 minus y minus 1 squared equal to 1. So we know the, the graph will be y minus 1. Um, <clears throat> okay, the, the slope will be, uh, how do I say it? x will be x squared over 25 equal to y squared, so y equal positive negative x over 5. So it's a very, very flat, very low. 1 over 5, 1, one 2, 3, 4, 5. So it's around like this. So this is the asymptote, asymptote line, yeah. this is the asymptote line, one, five, yeah, yeah, this is the asymptote line, and the foci, this is the vertex, vertex. The foci will be around 5.1, around, will be root 26 and 1. And here will be negative root 26 and 1. So, never, never, ever reach to that line. So this will be the, the graph. So it's something like this. So this is the graph, okay? Okay, so this one, I will do it. Uh, question number two. Not in a rush, I will do it nicely and clearly. x plus 1 square over 15 minus y square over 20 equal to 1. So first, the center will be negative 1 y is 0, and we know x is uh, x, the coefficient for, for x, the constant in front of x will be a positive, so the graph will be, the graph will be like this, right? like this, and 5 and 20, there is not a big difference, so the slope, the slope will not be too, uh, like last one, too, too dramatic. And under y is 20, so this one will be having um, y equal uh, positive negative uh, uh, 15 over 20 root. 20x. So this one, uh, three, four, one point three root one point three. It's a little bit slanted. I can see it's something like this, like this. Okay. Now I get a rough idea, and uh, the. The starting point, x is negative 1, so it's actually starting from here. Okay, we will do the, um, the detail a bit later. So a equal to 15, b equal to 20, c equal to um, a squared, 15, b squared, 25. 
c square is 15 plus 20 equal to uh, 35. So c equal to root 35. Okay, so vertex, vertex minus one vertex will be uh -huh, root fifteen minus one zero negative root fifteen minus one zero and uh, the the Fochi Fochi will be root uh, root thirty five minus one zero negative root thirty five minus one zero. Okay, so now we can draw on this paper. Question number two. So we first draw um, so the center is negative one zero. So here is the center. Here is the center and um, uh, root root fifteen is around three point um, no root fifteen will be um, three point um, eight around it so one two three four a little bit smaller than four. From here, one, two, three, four, a little bit smaller than four. So this will be uh, root 15 minus one, zero, the vertex. This will be negative root 15 minus one, zero, and 35. One, two, three, four. Thirty-five will be around six, almost six. Thirty-five, very close to six. Thirty-five, the root of thirty-five is very close to, to six. One, two, three, four, five, six, a little bit. So this will be root thirty-five minus one minus one zero one two three four five six little bit less so this will be negative root thirty five minus one zero and um, <coughs> x square over 25 over no over 15 equal to y square over 20 so y equal root uh, 3 over 4 x positive negative so from here uh, almost one a little bit almost one but a little bit slanted okay so we will do like this so this will be the asymptote and Almost one, a little bit more. This will be the asymptote. 
and this is the vertex right yeah vertex and full key so This will be the graph. So this is the graph. Okay, so for the second one, this is the graph. Now question number three. Question number three. 